Hello guys, welcome to my channels. Like I announced at the end of my last videos in today's review, I'm going to test this auto magnetic mug. For those of you guys who never seen this mug before, I'm gonna show you how it works. And for those of you guys who already know this mug and just want to listen some cons, you can skip this part and jump to the next chapter. All right, it's time to show you how it works. We have coffee. And we got some milk. And this is sugar. So let me add some coffee into the mug. Oh, come on. Let's add some sugar. Add some water. You simply just press the button. And we'll stir automatically for you. Alright, it looks cool, huh? That's the pro. It can stir your coffee very well. And I'm really satisfied with this process. And I don't need to look for another spoon to stir anymore. It's definitely not a gimmick at all. And I really enjoy it. So I, I guess I'm gonna keep it for uh, long term use. Okay, guys, um, I just finished cleaning this mug. Um, now it's time to show you the components of it. First, you just got a, a mug. And got a cover there is a small small object you can call it maybe a stirrer i don't know um this very thin and small object you just uh throw it inside the mug the magnetic force is gonna hold it in the mug and you just uh, press the button here so the small object is gonna rotate all right so that is how it works. It's pretty, pretty simple. Now is the time to tell you um, some cons. You know, there is uh, no product that is 100% perfect. So there are definitely some cons. So I'm going to tell you one by one. The first, at the bottom of this mug, there is a battery, which means that the electricity is involved. Although there is a rubber seal on the charging port and the design seems waterproof, but you'd better not put it into the dishwasher. That's the first con. And to be honest, there is no instruction to tell you whether you can put it into the dishwasher or not. I just assume I can't, which means I have to use my hand to wash it. It's not a very good news for me because I am a lazy person, but I can make cleaning process a little bit better. You can add some soap and turn the mug on and it can clean by itself. All right, that's the first cone. And the next cone is I worry about whether I can swallow this uh, small object by accident uh, while drinking coffee. You can say I'm too cautious or paranoid, but I'm I'm just afraid of drinking coffee if I don't if I don't put the cover on. You can drink coffee when the cover is on. I really suggest the factory can somehow make protection in the mug to prevent this uh, small object uh, dropping from the mug. Honestly, the magnetic force is uh, strong enough. Eh, I've already tested. Even I try to try my best to smash, to toast, or through the mug, I can't make this small object drop from the mug. But is the magnetic force gonna get weak if I use it for a long, long time? I just can't tell you, and I don't know. So I guess uh, my suggestion is you, you'd better to use it with cover on. The third con is when there is a little liquid in the mug. Please don't turn it on because uh, it will spill your uh, liquid all over the place like this. So combined with the second con, always put the cover on when you drink. The last con is you never lose this small object. 
especially when you clean it and don't let this uh, small object drop from the sink while washing. If that happens and you can't get it back, this mug is dead. Overall, I can give this mug 4.5 stars. You can buy it from Amazon. Again, it's not a gimmick. All right, that's it for uh, today's reviews. For my next review, I'm gonna test this gadget, the Apple Peeler, and the Apple Cutter, I guess. I really wanna see if it can peel Apple as fast as this advertisement shows. Let me show you.